Ah, good night, Father. Thank you for coming through and watching me. <coughs> go right into it. Uh, yeah. So I'm not too sure what this game's about, by the way. I just kind of went like, all right, I'll play it. There he is. Gabriel. Oh, thank you for the biddies. <clears throat> I guess that means another beer. Oh, yo, the lighting, though? Press left shift to run. I don't like how you're telling me to run already. <clears throat> Yeah, I was playing God. <laughs> Middle mouse to increase the flashlight rate. Oh, yo. Who builds a fence around their house without a door? What is that bullshit? All right, let's run. Someone better chill Fido out, man. I've seen you multitask, trying to fly and chew a worm at the same time. Disaster. <clears throat> Absolute disaster. What the? Oh my god, I... I jumped so hard that my fucking hand was on the... Mouse wheel and it spun and I moved. Something just crawled across the ground. And it looks like Sally's dad from... Uh, Nightmare Before Christmas. It's all I could see. So that's one thing that's interesting. I thought you were fucking going to bed. <laughs> Jeez, why did that scare me? Collect blue and green herbs to create useful po potions in the treatment tab. Okay, well, where are they? You gonna tell me? Jesus, all right, all right. So I just click on it? Yep. You picked up blue herb. Well, the blue ones are easy to see. I don't know about the green ones. They're kind of difficult. I thought the whole purpose was me finding both types of herbs so I can make a potion. That's prac. Is that a fucking fisher cat? Why are there, like, no other herbs anywhere? Yet there's blue colored things I can't pick up. Uh, hello? I'm almost there. Yeah, but... Yo, know, officer, can you fucking put your flashlight down? Jesus Christ. <laughs> fucking dick. <laughs> Explore the world and open suitcases and different chests to find interesting items. Okay. You gonna show me one, or...? How the hell do I get into this house? Also, this is a big house for Grandma. Holy shit. What am I walking through? These noises. <laughs> so it tells me to check for, like, boxes and stuff, and all I can find are fucking barrels, and you can't do anything with them. I'm very confused. Alright, barn action. I found a fucking bone. Oh, there's the key. Um. <laughs> fucking god damn it. Store's locked. How do I. Can I use the key? Like, oh, I see. You have to click it. This key opens your uncle's room next to the bathroom. Oh, okay. Like, none of these crates open or anything. And he's like, oh, make sure you, uh, look around. Thanks. What the fuck is that? Jesus. Alright, 
fuck that. Not interested in that part of the map. Are these all herbs I can grab? No, they're just fucking flowers. Collect secret items, explore secret places to activate new abilities in your inventory. Okay. Well, well, well. Finally inside. What the fuck? Grandma. Wooden door. Door is locked. Jesus. All about atmosphere in this bitch, huh? Oh, this is the bathroom. Clearly. But, uh, there's no sink? Yikes. Ah, what's this? Bones. My sick brother has outdone himself. Now he even leaves bones in different places. First in the niche, then in the tool shed, and now in the outhouse. I dumped it in the hay behind the stable. I used to give it to my dog, but why does Arthur need them? Edward. Okay. That was fucking horrific. Duh. All right, all right, I'm here. What? What? There's nothing even in here. What room is this? Is this another bathroom? These open? Oh, they do, okay. Uh, can I take the fucking scissors, please? No. Ooh. Secret item found. Oh, this must be my uncle's room. Huh. I mean... All things considered about this house, it doesn't look terrible in here. I will go right around the block here. What's that? Corn and three X's. Uh, well, <clears throat> clearly that's a cornfield on the left, and three X's mark the spots of something. Yo, a phone? Can I take that, please? Ooh. <clears throat> He's dead. Okay. At first he behaved strangely, and then he ran away from me until one day he disappeared. I searched for days and probably found him all bitten up. My best friend had been murdered. What kind of animal could do something like that? All these roars, noises, something bad is happening. I still can't believe in it. Rocky's dead, Edward. Oh. New task. What did I just pick up? Oh, right. I. I hate that. Um, cassette one. Okay. Task. Find a device. Listen to, listen to the cassette. Okay. Hmm. So we're apparently not at Grandma's house yet either. Interesting. I'll use the notes. Okay, I see. The treatment's good, but I can't find anything. Okay. Ah, uh, good night, Father. Thank you for coming through and watching me. <laughs> Was that? Oh. Oh. I think that light bulb just <laughs> light bulb blew out. Uh, anxiety is what I just felt. Uh, I hear roars even in the daytime and feel someone's presence. I'm disturbed by strange sounds in the forest. Plus, I feel the smell of a terrible stench. Have I gone mad? My siblings are also acting strangely as if they are afraid of something. I have to talk to them before it's too late. Can't open those, okay. Alright, that's it. That's his room. 
Also, why are there two beds in here if it's just one dude's room? Oh, I hate I hate the shadows. Oh god damn. Can you Oh, if you're in the way the door will not open. Hello? Is anybody here? It's me, Gabriel. Hello? I'm back. Grandma? Uncle Edward? Edward, uh, Gabriel, I don't think your family is here. I'm just going to go out on a limb. Or if they are, it's not really them anymore. Let me grab that. <clears throat> if you want to make God laugh, tell him about your plans. What are you yelling? <laughs> well, okay. Huh. I'm just going to... I'm going to leave that one alone. Oh, another note. Cornfield. I've been feeling strange lately. I feel like someone is watching me all the time. I have to hear rustling noises from the cornfield. It's very big, so once I went to check out the noises, I almost had a heart attack because of the scarecrow. i never seen him there before. Apparently, Edward had to put him there to protect the corn. I guess I'm oversensitive, Anna. Hi, Grandma. I'm sorry that I'm calling so late. I That's me. I to catch the bus and I had to wait for the next one. Don't worry. I will be there in a few minutes. I'm a bad. Okay, I need to finish. My brother is <laughs> Well, there's one. <laughs> Thank you for that. So that's us leaving a voicemail. So clearly never got it. Thoughtful Arthur. Arthur always enjoyed mysteries and constantly wanted to explore the world. He would check when to expect a storm and wait for the darkness to appear. He loved watching the sky lit by lightning and when a light breeze bent the grass and flowers. He had been leaving things in different places too often lately. Keys have already been in the stable, the garden, and even in our wooden outhouse next to the shed. And, uh... Excuse me. What we got here? <laughs> Is that my pappy? Rest in peace, Zeno. Huh. <clears throat> Father's mysterious book. Yesterday I was cleaning out the shed and found some strange old book. It turned out to be the pr property of my father, Zeno. It's filled with information about the monsters he used to scare us with when we were children. The description in it are very detailed. This isn't like him. If he was hiding something, then I need to find it out, Arthur. Oh boy. So Zeno found this shit. What the fuck? That is a weird looking hut. Wait. That's a... That's a grandfather clock, but it has a cuckoo noise. Quite confused. What's wrong with them? It's easy to go crazy with them in this house. Everyone has a normal feeling, but not me. Last night, Arthur came in with a bloody hand. The idiot cut himself with a knife. Every day he disappears, and you never know where he is. And it keeps inviting new guests. Lately, even my dog, Rocky, has been annoying me. He's my best friend. I always hide the keys on his dog house. Now he just runs off into the woods to that creek. Oh, to that creek. I was like, he called the dog a creek? I'm like, I was kind of confused. Observations. Flora. Plants are very sharp. can cut through human skin. There are lots of them, but not in every place. No mushrooms around. <clears throat> okay. Day. Nothing was noticed that would attract attention. Night. Strange sounds could be heard. Rustling. At first thought those were animals, but what animal makes such a frightening roar? Okay. I need to try the methods described in my father's book. Yo, where's this book at? Can we just start reading that immediately? And why is there a picture of a spider on the wall? That radio is going nuts, so kitchen cupboard is locked because, of course, it is. Jesus. Oh, what's this? Secret item. Closet in the hallway I can't open. Grandpa Zeno. After my father died, a lot has changed in my life. Edward goes out into the woods with Rocky more often, despite the ugly weather. Arthur has no time for anything. Conf disappears, trying to understand the world. I wasn't myself either, but who would be when you lose the most important person in your life? Now I'm feeling better. Alice... <coughs> Gross. Alice visits us often, and every year during the vacations, Gabriel comes. That's our character. Zeno is still with us. I can feel it, and he will take care of us up there. Anna. <laughs> no, he's not. 
Oh, there's a gate. Need oil or something similar. <laughs> hey, we can play Limbo. Damn it. More blue herb. I need some green herb, please. Give me that green herb. Oh, here we go. What is it? Picked up tip for collection. Notes help solve the riddles. Tip one. Oh, that's that's it. Notes help solve the riddles. Great. Jeez. What the fuck was that? Alright, and plus that's the edge of the property anyways. If I can't go that way. Oh, this is the cornfield. So there should be three X's on the ground when it's on my left. What what the fuck? I think I found it. Whatever I'm looking for here. Hello? There we go. Another tip. Herbs grow mostly in meadows. Okay. Well, I mean, that was helpful in a way. Oh, here's a box. Wait a minute, what? Picked up a file. Oh, there's a door. Maybe I can go in that way. No. The tool that will cut this wire. What fucking wire? Dude, jump the fucking fence. Lazy bastard. Like, can I get up on the roof this way or something? I mean, I can't really jump that high, so... Oh, the outhouse, right. Gross. Ugh. All right, now what is that key? Key to the closet. This key opens the kitchen cupboard. Okay. Oh. What? This book really got me hooked. Whoa. Because of it, I'm starting to get a little lost or rather lose things. I've lost my keys again. The only thing I recall is that they must have fallen out of my hand and I was preparing wood in the South Forest while I should find them. South Forest. Jesus fucking Christ, that was loud. Find the key Arthur lost. Map. Okay, well, if it's... On the map. That direction. Okay. <laughs> Fuck. Let's go right in. Not a fucking fan. I'm real close. But like, if he just dropped a key in the woods, like. <laughs> I can end up being on top of this fucking... Oh, no. This is where Uncle Arthur was working. I have to find the key. What? Yo, fuck off. I said fuck off. 
Jesus, I pick up a fucking key. All right, can I go? Can I go? Can I run? Run? I don't want to be in here anymore. Goodbye. Oh, fuck that. Oh, not fucking cool. <laughs> Why is there fog over here? What is going on? Weird. All right, so I think it's this one then. Yep. Bro. Dude, the audio fucks with me in this game so bad. Bastard. Yo, what? Why is there water in that trough? I'm glad I picked up all these fucking secret items. Oh, there's a chest over here. Another file. What is this? They exist. I killed two chickens and carried them to the woods and threw them in the creek. Suddenly I heard the noise of meat being torn apart and bones being crushed. I turned my flashlight on and saw strange creatures that looked like devils. They had sharp teeth and black eyes. They exist. They are real. I ran away quickly, Arthur. Yikes, bro. <laughs> Who was that? Hey, somebody's here? Oh, holy shit. Oil helps repair metal doors. Okay, cool. <clears throat> so that's the little fenced in area. I'm not afraid of you. Are you hear me? I'm not afraid of you. Dude with shovel comes outside. Home Alone references. It's okay, they're scripted events. He's actually not out here. Yet. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking bastard. <laughs> Thank you, Fry. Oh, really? Oh, that's where it is so far. Oh man, just as it started getting good too. You will suffer alone because you're a bird and you live in a nest. <laughs>